you hood educated, I'm glad you made it. Allow me to unfold my knowledge, wisdom, and understanding from a hood nigga's point of view to all of you here, there, and everywhere. Now, before we get into the video, do me a quick favor real quick and go on ahead and smash that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed already, and make sure you hit that notification bell so that you will be the first to get my videos when I drop them. Now, check it out. For the sake of context, right? Just to keep everybody up to date, right? We all understand that during February 2019, uh, there was a shooting that happened in Atlanta at the Varsity, right? Where King Von, Lil Dirt, Hella Bands, and Bay Zoo was all accused of having partake in the shooting, okay? Slash robbery. Now, when Lil Dirk heard that, you know, he was being accused of this crime, he turned himself in May 30th, 2019, right? June 2019, he got a bond, paid 250,000. Mm, get me up out of here. You know, turn me loose, right? Cool. So now what I need, I need y'all to, to walk with me on this one and we need to get a full understanding, right? Because I believe this right here is a bomb I'm about to drop. And I hope that it set uh, 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 the internet on fire. I'm not going to lie to you, right? Now, the first thing we got to understand is this right here. Like I mentioned before, Lil Dirt, Hella Bands, King Von, Bezu, all on the same case, right? Now, we got to understand this. Out of all of them, Lil Dirt is the only one remaining free. He's the only one still out here taking care of his business. Unfortunately, King Von got killed in Atlanta. Unfortunately, Hella Bands got killed in Miami. Y'all correct me if I'm wrong. Unfortunately, the brother Bezu just got knocked in Chicago for toting them poles, right? You know, they saying that the man had beams on the guns. They saying that the man had armor piercing bullets and things like that, right? Okay. Now, I need us all to understand something. I need us to, to agree on something, right? Now, let's understand something. Whenever you get charged for a crime, right? I don't care what that crime is. You get a court date. Can we all agree on that right there, right? Now the world been going crazy about when is the court date for the King Von, Hella Bands, Bezu, Lil Dirk, Atlanta case. Everybody been wondering, when is the court date? Why? Because it's been years, right? Because this thing happened in 2019, we're in 2022. It's been years. So everybody wondering, when is the court date, right? So now let's, let's go back. Whenever you get charged for a crime, especially a crime, you get a court date. Why? Because at this court date, this is what happens. Especially if you plead guilty, right? And even if, especially if you pled guilty, or especially if you pled not guilty, you get a court date. Why? Because of this right here, y'all. The state got to prove that you guilty. And if you saying that you're not guilty, you got to prove to the state, hey, I'm not guilty, right? And that's why we have a judicial system. That's why we have courts, right? So can we all agree on that? that if you get charged with a crime, you get a court date, right? Now, let me ask y'all this right here. We understand that Dirk was charged with first degree attempted murder, assault, felony in possession of a uh, weapon, uh, felony in possession of a weapon in the commission of a crime and uh, a street gang charge. This is what they charged Lil Durk with, right? So he should have a court date. There should be a court date coming up for that crime, right? Being that 
it's dealing with causing harm to another person. Being that somebody got shot and almost lost their life, he should have a court date, right? Well, let's see. Check it out. Thank you for contacting the Fulton County Clerk of Superior and Magistrate Courts, where Kathleen Tina Robinson serves as clerk. Due to the coronavirus pandemic, some of our operations may have changed. Visit our website at www.fultonclerk.org for details. Our website also allows you to interact with our chat bot to assist with general questions or engage with a live chat representative regarding more specific inquiries. Please listen closely for our menu options. To speak with a clerk, press 1. For office hours and location, press 2. To repeat these options, press 9. Your call may be monitored or recorded for quality assurance. Thank you for calling. Please hold for the next available clerk. Um, I'm trying to uh, find out uh, a court date for my friend, and I got the uh, the case number here. Yes, the case number is one nine CP one eight three nine seven three. And uh, what's this person name? Dirk Banks. Do you need the middle name too? The middle name is Derek. No upcoming court dates. What could that possibly mean? Does that mean that the case dismissed or something like that? That means he does like that. That means he does not have a court date. Hmm. Because we was expecting that him to have a court date soon. But so he just they just say he don't. We can just see that when I pull his case up, it's telling me the status is open. But it it is no it doesn't show me a court date. Now he um, it will really be up to the uh, the Fulton County District Attorney's Office how they want to proceed with this case. Appreciate it. Just one more question be- right. before I let you go. Just one more question. So being that the case opened, that don't mean that the case dismissed. Is that correct? Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right, thank you, and you have a good day, sister. All right, thank you. You too. All right. Oh, okay, bye bye. Enjoy your week. You too. All right, bye bye. Thank you. Now, did y'all hear what that woman just said? Uh uh-uh. uh. No, I'm talking about listen. No, uh uh-uh. uh. Did y'all just hear what that woman just said? Y'all heard what I said. I asked the woman. I say, look, I'm calling for my friend. Gave her the full name and everything and was like, hey, look, I'm trying to check on this court date. What she asked me for? She said, give me the give me the case number. I gave it to her. Y'all heard me. I gave her the case number. What she say? Ain't got no court date. How? How is this possible? I, look, man, I'm talking about, listen, man, it blew my mind. How is this possible? How don't? How do you not have a court date, Lil Dirt? And, and I can hear y'all jumping in the comments talking about, man, he a superstar and all this old type of sh- Listen, let me tell y'all something. When it comes to court, all that superstar shit and all, that shit go out the window. That shit go out the window. Court is public information. 
Do y'all understand that 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 court is open? Anybody can walk into a you can right now today. If they was having court in the, in the courtroom in your state, a regular citizen can walk inside that courtroom and watch a murder case, watch a rape case, watch any type of it's public case court cases is public. It's not we ain't they can't hide nothing. To, no, it got to be public. That's just how it goes. So that argument is dead. And I can hear y'all jumping in here to myself. Hey man, the COVID man, that's why it's taking so long for the that's why you probably ain't got no no uh-uh. They doing court cases via Zoom. Uh-uh. No. Uh-uh. So that that y'all can get out the way with that right there too. Listen to me. Something ain't right. Something ain't right. Now, it's some of y'all in my audience right now. Y'all probably got driving tickets that y'all trying to fight. Y'all got the court date. It's probably some of y'all in my audience right now that got drug cases, pistol cases, and all that. You got a court date. This man right here got a first degree attempt at murder. Somebody almost lost their life. How he ain't got no court date? Now, my confidential and liable informants and snitches and shit that pay attention to my channel, they probably know why he ain't got no court date. Because one thing we got to understand is this right here. When you working for law enforcement, they take that court date. They take that off. No, he can't give him no court date. Why? Because he working for us. Right? He working. We can't put no court date on him. We can't put no rush on him like that. We got to let him lock up as many people as he, as he can, tell on as many people as he can before we can even give him a court date and before we can even hook him up the way that we want to hook him up. It depends on how much work he put in. Come on, man. Y'all ain't hear me. I know y'all don't want to believe it. That's y'all favorite rapper. I understand that right there. Well, explain to me how he ain't got no court day. When everybody in America that commits a crime get a court day. We know YFN, uh, YFN Lucci court day. We knew uh, Casanova court day, right? We know YSL, uh, Young Thug, and we know they court day. Dirk in Atlanta right down there with him. How come he ain't got no court day? You see what I'm saying? Things just ain't sitting right. Things ain't looking right. And the only thing that I can come to that I can believe in my mind, using my wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, is that dirt got to be working with them people, bro. Now, I know a lot of people might not want to say that, but I got to, though, because it's like, what other reason could it be? What other reason could it be, y'all, that this man ain't got a court date and everybody in America got a court date? Some of y'all got caught for jaywalking. And you trying to fight it in the court, you get in the court day. Like I said before, some of y'all got speeding tickets. You, you you trying to fight it, you get in the court day. Come on now. Mm -mm. We hood educated, not lane related. Y'all heard what that lady said. And then she kind of got mad at me when I said, like, what you mean he ain't got a she what it say? He ain't got a court day. She got hot, like, check the nigga, like, nigga, look, he ain't got no court day. And what? See, now let me tell you something. We hood educated, not lame related. This the type of shit, man, that any of you niggas that's out there running around playing in them streets, if you out there robbing, selling dope, you killing, you kidnapping, whatever you out there doing, if you doing anything in the underworld, when your partner get knocked for some real shit, yeah, you need to be, let me see, man, when this nigga next court date is. Yeah, when he when his next court date is so I can find out what's going on with this nigga. Because I'm telling y'all, ain't no way in the hell you got an open case, but you ain't got no court date. Somebody jump in the comments and let me know. Explain this to me. Y'all heard what the sister said. I asked her, I said. So does that mean that the case is dismissed? She said, no, if it was dismissed, it would have been closed. It would have been closed if it was dismissed. It wasn't closed. It's open. This hood educated, not lame related. 
Peace and love, y'all. Take care of y'all self out there. And make sure, man, y'all smash them likes for me. If you ain't subscribed already, make sure you subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Share the hell out this video because we need to get this out there to the public. People need to know that they favorite rapper got an open case, but ain't got no court date. It don't make no sense. Don't make no sense at all. Peace and love, and y'all take care of y'all, sir.